Welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to create a Microsoft Azure account. All right. So first up, go ahead and open up your favorite browser and type in azure.com and just hit on enter. Wait for it to load. As you can see here, we can go ahead and click on get started with Azure. Just click on it and you'll be landed to this page. And what we're going to do is just go ahead and click on try Azure for free. Or you can go ahead and click pay as you go. All right. Now, when we scroll down right here, as you can see here, are the perks of an Azure free account. And this is for the pay as you go perks. All right. You can go ahead and pause the video and uh, read it out yourself. All right. Going back in here, I'm just going to click on try Azure for free. Now it's going to open up a new tab where it says Azure.login. And here, just go ahead and uh, sign in with your Microsoft account. And if you don't have one, go ahead and click on create one. Okay. I'm going to head on next right here. Wait for the website to load. Now, once it loads, let's just go ahead and fill up this uh, form where you would need to enter your uh, country or region, first name, middle name, last name, and your address. Okay. Once you have put your uh, phone number, just go ahead and click on either text me or call me for you to have your verification code. As you can see here, here is my verification code. I'm just going to copy it and paste that in here and click on verify code. Now let's just go ahead and put our TIN. If you have a TIN, that is optional. All right. Address line right here. I'm just going to go ahead and put that. And I'm going to scroll down and click all these tick box. All right. Tick, tick, tick and hit on next. Again, next. Right here, as you can see, it will require an identity verification by card. And it says here, don't worry, there are no automatic charges. After your credit card is over, we'll ask you if you want to continue with pay as you go. If you do, you'll only pay if you use more than the free amounts of services. All right. So I'm just going to fill this up. Once that's done, just go ahead and scroll all the way down and click on the big sign up button. All right. Now it says here, we should protect our account. So let's just go ahead and hit on next. And once you're in here, just simply click on go to Azure portal. Click on it and wait for it to load. And as you can see here, we are now at portal.azure.com and ready for use. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.